Hi guys and welcome back to my channel once again. Um, we're not looking at anything in particular in this video. I just thought I would upload a video to talk to you guys and tell you guys about some of the ideas I've had for upcoming videos. Um, there's quite a few, quite a few in the thought process. Um, one of which I've um, I'm on quite a few pay Facebook pages and uploaded a picture of this a while ago after I'd given it a nice little polish. Um, and I had quite a few people message me asking me what I used, how I did it. So I was thinking of maybe uploading a video showing you all how to make your mugs nice and shiny again. That's why I'm letting this one get a little bit mucky at the moment. Um, just to sort of show you how, how well it comes out, regardless of how filthy it is or how long it's been since you've cleaned it, how shiny you can make it. Uh, that's one idea. The other one I have is showing you guys all how to make your own juice as I make mine all the time and it is a big money saver and it's fun experimenting playing around with all the different concentrates it is pretty good um, another one is I might do a couple of trick tutorials nothing special no like I can't do any jellyfishes or splits or anything but um, I might at some point show you all how to blow hoops for those that don't already know um, how to make a tornado up off the table, break smoke onto a table, make it go up in a tornado. Like loads of little bits like that. I mean, I might um, I might review something other than a mod or a dripper as well. I might review my coil jig and stuff like that, or flavour concentrates, tell you how flavour concentrates are and you know how how much percentage to use. There's there's a lot of questions that are asked frequently on um on the Facebook pages, there are a lot of vaping pages on Facebook and there's quite a few questions that are regularly asked. And it's it's little things, it's little things that those that have been vaping for a while know how to do and don't even think about the fact that there are some out there that don't know how to do it. Like another video I might do is I might show you how to rewrap your batteries because even though a lot of people already know how to do it, they do it regularly. There are others out there that are sort of only just transitioning from built-in battery to removable batteries. And there's loads of people always online asking, oh, this tiny little scratch in my battery, is it still safe to use? You could risk it, but the bottom line, with the impact these batteries have when they go bang, is it worth the risk? No. So I'll show you how easy it is to rewrap your batteries. In the description to that video, I'll probably put a link at the bottom. A couple of places you can buy battery wraps. They're not expensive at all. Um, but yeah, so there, there's quite a few ideas. I'll be uploading quite a few things. I mean, I might I'll even do a review of my mech mod. Um, I mean, there's not much of a review you can do to it because there's no sort of circuitry. There's nothing sort of that's going to be better or worse. It's more... With the mech mods, it's sort of more the build quality and the design. That's all it is. At the end of the day, it's a metal case that you complete the circuit of a battery to the coil. It depends more. It's performance. You can't really say if a mech mod is better than another mech mod on performance because it depends on the coil you put in it. It depends on your build. It depends on your wick. It nothing to do with that really i mean the airflow might the the drip will still have an impact you've got your airflow and the chamber inside that's still going to have an impact but the actual mod itself is not going to impact the performance in any way at all it's purely build quality and design um so yeah so we'll have a little look at this um i've got another dripper as well that i need to do a review of i've got a tank as well that I could have a look at. I've got a couple of juices that I've bought rather than made. I bought some specially so I can have a look at them, do a little review on them, and let you guys know what they're like. So yeah, so they're all the ideas at the moment. So hopefully over the next couple of days I will be quite busy. Um, work's been a bit busy at the moment, that's why I haven't really uploaded that many videos. So yeah, anyway, so I hope to see all you guys soon with one of them. I don't know what one I'm going to do first. So, yeah, see you later, guys, and thanks for watching. Please like the video. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, and I will see you again soon. Bye.